If you've ever savored the crisp sweetness of an apple and wondered about growing your own tree, you're in the right place. In this video, we'll guide you through the process of planting apple seeds and nurturing them into healthy, fruit-bearing trees. While it may seem daunting at first, planting apple seeds is a rewarding and straightforward endeavor that anyone can undertake with a little patience and care. So let's dive in and explore the fascinating journey of growing apple trees from seeds. Apple seeds are fascinating little packages of potential, containing the genetic blueprint for a new apple tree. When you bite into an apple and encounter the seeds, you're holding the key to future orchards in your hand. Each seed carries the unique characteristics of its parent apple, which means that planting apple seeds can result in a diverse array of flavors, sizes, and colors in the apples that eventually grow. To understand how to plant apple seeds effectively, it's essential to grasp a few key concepts about their nature. Firstly, apple seeds require a period of cold stratification to germinate successfully. This process mimics the natural conditions they would experience during winter in their native habitat. Cold stratification helps break the seed's dormancy and prepares it for growth when warmer temperatures return. Secondly, it's important to recognize that not all apple seeds will produce trees with desirable fruit. Apple trees grown from seeds are not true to type, meaning they may not resemble the parent tree or produce the same quality of fruit. Commercial apple varieties are typically propagated through grafting or budding to ensure consistency in fruit characteristics. Lastly, apple seeds contain cyanide compounds in their outer coating, which can be harmful if ingested in large quantities. While the risk of poisoning from apple seeds is minimal, it's advisable to avoid consuming them and to keep them out of reach of children and pets. Before you can plant apple seeds, you'll need to gather the necessary materials and prepare them for sowing. Start by collecting seeds from ripe apples. Choose a variety of apples that you enjoy eating, as the characteristics of the parent apple will influence the traits of the resulting tree. Extract the seeds from the core of the apple and rinse them clean of any fruit residue. Since apple seeds require cold stratification to germinate, you'll need a container and a medium to simulate this process. A common method is to place the seeds in a damp paper towel or peat moss inside a sealable plastic bag. This setup mimics the cool, moist conditions needed for stratification. Find a spot in your refrigerator where you can store the stratification container for several weeks. The seeds need to be exposed to temperatures between 32 and 40 degrees Fahrenheit or 0 to 4 degrees Celsius for a period of 4 to 8 weeks to break their dormancy. Check the seeds periodically to ensure they remain moist but not waterlogged. Once the seeds have undergone stratification, you'll need potting mix and containers for sowing them. Choose a well-draining potting mix suitable for seed starting and use small containers or seed trays with drainage holes to plant the seeds. Fill the containers with the potting mix, leaving about half an inch of space at the top. Keep a watering can or spray bottle handy to moisten the potting mix after planting the seeds. Water gently to avoid displacing the seeds or compacting the soil too much. By gathering these materials and preparing them in advance, you'll be ready to start the process of planting apple seeds and nurturing them into healthy young seedlings. Now that you have your materials ready, it's time to plant the apple seeds and provide them with the care they need to germinate and grow into healthy seedlings. Begin by filling your containers or seed trays with the prepared potting mix. Ensure the soil is evenly moist but not waterlogged. Plant the apple seeds about half an inch to an inch deep in the soil, spacing them a few inches apart. Gently press the soil down around the seeds to ensure good contact. After planting the seeds, water the soil thoroughly, but avoid saturating it. Keep the soil consistently moist, but not overly wet throughout the germination process. Place the containers in a warm, well-lit area, such as near a sunny window or under grow lights. Apple seeds require plenty of light to germinate, so ensure they receive at least six to eight hours of sunlight per day. Germination can take several weeks to a few months, so be patient and continue to monitor the containers regularly. Keep the soil moist and watch for signs of germination, such as the emergence of tiny seedlings. Once the seedlings have sprouted, continue to provide them with adequate light and water, adjusting as needed to maintain optimal growing conditions. As the seedlings grow larger and develop true leaves, they will eventually outgrow their containers. When this happens, carefully transplant them into larger pots or directly into the garden if outdoor conditions permit. Handle the seedlings gently, being careful not to disturb their delicate roots. 
Once the seedlings are established, continue to care for them by providing regular watering, sunlight, and occasional fertilization with a balanced fertilizer. Monitor for pests and diseases, and take appropriate measures to address any issues that arise. As the seedlings grow, gradually acclimate them to outdoor conditions before transplanting them into the garden permanent. Once your apple seedlings have developed into sturdy young trees, it's essential to continue providing them with proper care to ensure their healthy growth and eventual fruit production. Pruning is an important practice for shaping the tree, removing dead or diseased branches, and promoting fruit production. It's best done during the dormant season, typically in late winter or early spring before new growth begins. Use sharp, clean pruning tools and make clean cuts to avoid damaging the tree. In addition to pruning, apple trees benefit from regular fertilization to provide them with essential nutrients for growth and fruit production. Apply a balanced fertilizer formulated for fruit trees in early spring before new growth begins, following the manufacturer's recommendations for application rates and timing. Adequate water is crucial for apple trees, especially during periods of active growth and fruit development. Provide consistent moisture to the tree's root zone, ensuring the soil remains evenly moist but not waterlogged. Water deeply and infrequently, allowing the soil to dry out slightly between watering sessions. Applying a layer of organic mulch, such as wood chips or compost, around the base of the apple tree can help retain soil moisture, suppress weeds, and regulate soil temperature. Keep the mulch several inches away from the trunk to prevent moisture-related issues and discourage pests. Regular monitoring for pests and diseases is essential to keep your apple trees healthy. Look for signs of common pests like aphids, mites, and codling moths, as well as diseases such as apple scab and powdery mildew. Integrated pest management techniques, including cultural practices, biological controls, and targeted pesticide applications can help manage pest and disease issues effectively. Most apple varieties require cross-pollination from another compatible apple tree to set fruit successfully. Ensure you have at least two compatible apple varieties planted within close proximity to facilitate pollination. Alternatively, consider planting a self-fertile apple variety that does not require a pollination partner. Thinning fruit clusters on your apple trees once they have reached marble size can promote larger, healthier apples and prevent branch damage from excessive fruit weight. Remove excess fruit, leaving only one or two apples per cluster. In regions with harsh winters, provide winter protection for your apple trees to prevent cold damage and reduce the risk of frost cracks or sun scald. Wrapping the trunk with tree wrap or painting it with white latex paint can help reflect sunlight and minimize temperature fluctuations. Despite your best efforts, apple trees can encounter various problems that may affect their health and productivity. Being aware of these issues and knowing how to address them promptly can help you maintain healthy apple trees in your garden. One common problem with apple trees is pest infestations. Aphids, codling moths, apple maggots, and spider mites are among the most common pests that attack apple trees, feeding on foliage, fruit, and tender shoots. To control these pests, consider using integrated pest management, IPM strategies, including cultural practices like pruning, biological controls such as beneficial insects, and targeted pesticide applications when necessary. Regular monitoring for pest activity and early intervention can help prevent widespread damage. Apple trees are also susceptible to various diseases, including apple scab, powdery mildew, fire blight, and cedar apple rust. These diseases can affect leaves, fruit, and branches, reducing the tree's vigor and fruit yield. To manage apple tree diseases, practice good sanitation by removing and disposing of fallen leaves and fruit. Choose disease-resistant apple varieties whenever possible, and apply fungicides according to label instructions if disease pressure is high. Pruning diseased branches and promoting good air circulation around the tree can also help reduce the risk of fungal infections. Another issue that apple trees may face is nutrient deficiencies, particularly nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium. Symptoms of nutrient deficiencies include yellowing leaves, stunted growth, and poor fruit development. To address nutrient deficiencies, Conduct a soil test to determine the nutrient levels in your soil and apply appropriate fertilizers or soil amendments to correct any imbalances. Organic fertilizers like compost, well-rotted manure, and fish emulsion can provide slow-release nutrients to support the apple tree's growth and development. Environmental factors such as extreme temperatures, drought, and frost can also stress apple trees and impact their health. 
providing adequate irrigation during dry periods, mulching to conserve soil moisture, and protecting young trees from frost damage with frost blankets or row covers can help mitigate these environmental stressors. Additionally, selecting apple varieties that are well adapted to your climate can improve their resilience to adverse weather conditions. Lastly, apple trees may suffer from poor fruit set or irregular fruit development, leading to smaller or misshapen apples. This problem can be attributed to inadequate pollination, nutrient imbalances, or improper pruning. To improve fruit set, encourage pollinator activity by planting pollinator-friendly flowers nearby and ensure proper pruning to promote healthy fruiting wood and airflow within the tree canopy. By addressing these common apple tree problems proactively and implementing appropriate management strategies, you can maintain healthy, productive apple trees in your garden and enjoy a bountiful harvest of delicious apples year after year. Growing apple trees can be a rewarding experience, but it requires careful attention to their needs and proactive management of common issues. By understanding the basics of apple tree care, from selecting suitable varieties to addressing pests, diseases, and environmental stressors, you can cultivate healthy trees that produce abundant fruit. Remember to monitor your apple trees regularly, provide them with proper care, and seek assistance from local gardening resources or experts if needed.